Hello Sagittarius, how are you? Thank you for joining me. Thank you for sharing your energy with me. This is a general reading for your Sagittarius placements for the week of the 28th, I believe. Okay. Um, I decided to just pull names or yeah, I pulled you out of a deck. You were the first one up. This is a brand new setup. Don't get used to it. Don't think I like it, but that's okay. However, I had already started your reading and something happened. So we're going to pick up from here because it is already very interesting. And I'm going to tell you what your first message was from the first meditation, but we're going to do it again. All right. If you want to skip past this part, it's going to be about one minute. Otherwise, nice straight spine, deep in through the nose and out through the mouth. Here we go. Okay, um, <clears throat> the last time I recorded, I got you going through things wondering why you still had what you had, going, that no longer fits in my life, that no longer fits, why am I still holding on to this? So that can be your spring cleaning, you're going through the garage, um, you're going through your drawers, or emotional, emotionally things from your past you're going through and you're going, yeah, I just, I'm not holding on to this anymore. It's not a part of who I am. It's no longer on my path. So you're cutting things out of your life, physically, metaphorically, whatever. Okay. Energetically. And then I got a knock on the door and... I'm rather disturbed by this. So the first thing I want to do is find out about this knock on the door. This is news coming in. This is someone arriving. Ace of Cups with the star. Why would I be disturbed by that? Why would I be disturbed by the Ace of Cups? with the star card that is there's something not right about this i don't know justice on the bottom nine of pentacles and justice something's balanced out because of this but what is this what is this news coming in what is this knock on the door about what is this about please i just saw the ten of cups Wheel of Fortune, it's time to make a decision. It's time to make a decision, which is interesting with the cards that have already come out for you. Ace of Pentacles, a new beginning, two aces. You're looking at something. Someone's cutting something out. star card you could very be dealing with an Aquarius you also have the star card over here the star card is all about healing and wishes and dreams and oh, what is this about oh my god Sagittarius again you saw I shuffled I shuffled there's no way these could be together again they were on the cut
Pisces energy, hangman. King of Wands taking action to victory. Oh my gosh, this is going to cause a fight. Could be a Capricorn, but someone's been planning. This is bringing in balance. It's bringing in karmic justice. Tower card on the bottom. Yeah, I bet. Five of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, Hermit, Ace of Cups. There's a communication. Eight of Cups, Judgment, Fool, Magician. Okay, in your Sunday reading, I picked up something about getting caught with your shoes off um, and possible hinky business. Whatever this is, you're not trusting it. Okay, Sag. Walking away so that you're walking away from something. You're oh, going within, finding your inner light. You, what the hell is this? Something is coming to an abrupt ending but but the thing is is that it's leading you exactly where you need to go holy crap i don't know what this is sag it's a general reading but whatever it is it's manifested okay and it's karmically just you may be getting Someone may be leaving a relationship. Which is crazy because of what's up here. Somebody wants victory. There's going to be a fight. About stability. Because it's... You don't trust it. Whatever this is, you don't trust it. It's like, is this too good to be true or you're in shock? I, that's what I'm getting. I'm getting shock, Sag. I'm getting shock, okay? But whatever it is, it is leading you to love yourself, to move forward. It's pushing you to move forward. Get out of your head. Are you worried you can't do it? Yeah, it's a big shock. Oh, yeah, this is a shock. This is a big shock to you. Why? Why is this a big shock to Sagittarius? There's too many stories, too many different outcomes, too many different um, karmas. Some, okay, okay, listen, listen closely. Some of you, if you have good karma coming in, this is your payoff. If you do not have good karma coming in and you have negative karma coming in, this is your payoff. You are so conflicted about doing this, about going through this. Is Am I going to be able to do it? Am I going to be able to do it? That's what I'm getting. Am I going to be able to do it? Yes. Yes. Whether whether this is a divorce, papers be arriving, whether this is someone saw you on the street and now they want to put you in show business, whether this is whatever this is, there is so much, am I going to be able to do this? Yes. The answer undoubtedly is yes. Okay? You can do this. You have no clue what this is about. Air chalice and hope was your overall energy. So you really want this. You really want this to work out. You are in your head, but you have you are having faith. You are having faith. Okay. I don't know who's going to resonate with this, but holy crap. You remember the star with the hermit? You got the star right here. King of Summer, Ten of Winter, King of Autumn, Star Card, King of Fire, Page of Earth, 
eight of water, four of air. You've got a choice to make. And you want a break. You're hoping that you have time. This can be between two people. I hope you have a plan. Oh, you want your happily ever after. Oh, you are so nervous. Oh, you're nervous. Why are you so nervous, Sag? Put in the work. Work the plan. Holy crap. Oh my God, Sag. I'm feeling so overwhelmed right now. I don't know what this is, but it's so good. Quick movements. There's the star card again. And the eight of cups again, because you have it right here. Wheel of fortune, six of wands. Six of Cups. God, you've been wanting this for so long. You've been dreaming about this. <sighs> Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I do it? That's all I keep hearing in my head. I don't know what this is. I'm getting like 100 stories at once. And I can't make out one over the other. It's going to be different for all of you. Knight of Wands, the world, three of pentacles. You've got all pentacles up here with the Empress. This could have a lot to do with work. Two of cups and your higher self. You are being called forward, Sagittarius. Whatever this is, you are being called forward. This is going to end up being much larger than you think it's going to be. Or you know that it's, it has the potential of this, okay? I feel so overwhelmed. Hold on. Let me clear my, my energy. Okay. Okay. Um, now that I get out of your headspace, because I can't read the cards if I'm in your headspace. Um, oh, my God. What am I going to do? Oh, my gosh. Things are going to move forward so quickly now. There's excitement, all right? Don't doubt yourself, Sag. Do not doubt yourself on this. Take it always. Okay, now in these times right now, always verify everything, all right? Make sure, because everything is a freaking scam now because of something with the astrology. I don't know. But um, it checks out real. You go. It checks out real, you go, all right? And I don't think that there's going to be a problem with uh, it being verified, all right? Whatever this is will be verified, ver verifiable. Get clarity on anything you need clarity on, all right, Sagittarius? You get clarity on anything you need clarity on. Even if you think, okay, listen closely to me. Listen closely to this part. Even if you think that this is negative in manner and you don't know how you're going to get through this, know this. This is balancing out the karma of the past situations so that you can move forward into your abundance. The Empress was there. Leaving something behind is going to move you forward at a much faster rate than you can imagine. All right? Things are getting balanced out, Sag. You're gonna get some kind of news in. Oh, strength. Okay. Strength card only shows up when um, you need strength. You have st the strength to do this, whatever this is. I have a feeling this is you having the strength to walk away from something. All right. 
Three of Ariel. Do what you love. Do what you love, Sag. A time of great personal growth in your artistic or career endeavors. Working with others in co cooperative manner. Whatever is coming in, because you had all those pentacles, this could be a career change. I have a feeling some there's somebody that's watching this that is getting spotted and is being approached. Okay. Let's get a, an advice card. Guys, if you don't know, I go live on Sundays, 3 p.m. Central Standard Time. I do all 12 signs. Do check those out. Um, they're time stamped. I also give free weekly readings as well as answer questions through Super Chat. Sagittarius, please. Advice card for Sagittarius. If you are interested in a personal reading, turnaround time is generally 48 hours. Emails in the description box below. Wisdom and Nine of Fire. Why not? You got the Hermit card. There's the Hermit card again. Okay, Major Arcana, Wisdom. Sag, I'm, I, I'm, my, I've got butterflies in my stomach now. I have no idea what this could be. Okay. Knowledge, understanding, awareness, self-knowledge, illumination, introspection, withdrawal, insight, common sense. <sighs> Sad, you're about to go on a journey. I'm so freaking excited. Now, now I have excitement because it's like the, um, the shock. After the shock is excitement, okay? This is really going to be good. You are here to become wise. Knowledge does not make you wise. Wisdom is learning from one's mistakes. Apply knowledge. Can you see it? Apply knowledge, logic, and common sense. Learn from more than just books. Seek out your elders. Time to take a break, which we have that over here. Wisdom is understanding. Wisdom is loving the whole. Know and love your shadow. You have unlimited potential. The road ahead leads to many destinations. And then we have nine of fire. I believe that's fire. Nine of fire, attainment, fruition, inspiration, creation, ease, simplicity, detachment, and restrictions. Move through life with confidence, a time of fruition and attainment. Knowledge and experience bring ease. Do not seek praise or affirmation. Give your best every time. Once you have finished, move on. Simplify your life. Remove obstructions and restrictions. Sag, you need to clean out your closet. You're about to be you're about to move forward. Okay, we have one more card. Um This is these are angel cards. Universal, angelically inspired. So, I'm going to pull you a card. This one really wants to come out. Clarity. Clearness, to make easier to understand, clarify, become clear, clear, transparent to the eye. Drawing this card can indicate you could be too close to your issue. You may have allowed your ego or emotions to cloud your inner knowing. 
take a step back, detach, and then look at the larger picture to see clearly. Remember to ask for clarity. Remember what I said? Ask for clarity. It says right here, remember to ask for clarity. State your issue precisely and unemotionally, then release it to the universe. <sighs> Get clarity, Sag. It's time for clarity. Okay? And buckle up because... I have a feeling this is going to get real interesting. <laughs> All right. You guys have a good week. You know I love you. I'll see you soon. Peace to you. Ciao.